Well, when the Gun Trace Task Force scandal broke out, Count Baltimore rapper Young Moose among the least surprised. Kevron Evans, he rapped about his run in with Detective Daniel Hersel actually years before. WJC is live. Paul Gester talked to Young Moose today after he reached a six figure settlement with the city. Paul. Well, Vic and Rick, Young Moose rapped about corrupt police. Now he's a free man, and he says many of those officers who were behind those arrests are now in prison themselves. Because I'm off the hook, because I'm off the chain. Baltimore rapper Young Moose has millions of views on YouTube before and after his incarcerations. Everything he worked hard to build was destroyed by somebody with a vendetta that we will never know about. Can't stop what God got planned. Evans told us Friday at his attorney's office music labels were interested until he says BPD detective Daniel Hersel planted drugs and falsified arrest warrants. Yeah, hey, a lot of people wanting to work with me. When I got arrested, it's like I was like a young black kid that just kept messing up. Baltimore's Board of Estimates last week approved a $300,000 settlement to Evans, who filed a lawsuit seeking $1.5 million from the city. The lawsuit alleged false imprisonment and malicious prosecution. He's now free, and Herschel is serving an 18 year prison sentence for his role in the Gun Trace Task Force scandal. Evan says while Herschel was the officer who harassed him most, he also had run ins with other members of that squad, mostly here in the Eastern District, where he says he lost a lot of friends during his time locked up and wonders if they'd still be alive at his music career taken off. We've been in a whole other city somewhere having fun or just in a different place. So I feel as though that wouldn't have happened. More harassment, more charges. Evans portrayed himself on HBO's We Own This City, the miniseries depicting the actions of the Gun Trace Task Force. Now, nearly 10 years after his first arrest, Evans has big hopes for where he'll be in the next 10 years. Kick back with my feet up, house size of Dr. Dre house, something like that. Daniel Hersel's attorney tells us in part Hersel maintains his innocence of all charges against him regarding any interaction between him and Evans. Evans, young moose, tells me he's got new music dropping at the end of the month. Reporting live at 6 outside City Hall, I'm Paul Gessler for WJZ.